Yo, what is going on everyone? This is Saint Denial, and I'm here with episode 3 of our Pokemon brand Nuzlocke. Now, if you remember the last episode, we had to restart right at the beginning because I lost a lock in episode 1. Uh, last episode went a lot better, and now here we are in Merson Cave. We've seen these ladders up here, there's another pair of ladders to the south. I'm going to work out which way we need to go. Uh, if we just have a look, I've done a little bit of grinding in between episodes. Oh, that's loud in my ear, Jesus. Let me turn that shit down. That is more like it. Right. So if we have a look, we have got uh, our Redeemer, which is Zubat. Now up to level 11, and he's learned Supersonic, which he learned at level 10. And then I've, if I remember rightly, I was looking this up earlier on, he learns Bite at level 15. So uh, it's going to be a little bit more of a grind until then. And I've also have on the team Squirtle at level 12. Nothing new to report there. Right, so let's continue. And the first order of business, oh. Well, there we go. I guess we're not moving anyway, so I'm a Geo dude. Ah, so obviously while I've been grinding, I've not been back to the uh, Pokemon Center, or rather back to my mum's ass. So I guess we're going to struggle our way through this battle, which is absolutely fine because I'll now switch out and put Squirtle in front, and we should be okay then to uh, smash our way through the rest of the cave. In fact. Maybe a better thing to do might be to just go back and heal anyway. Rah. I do like the struggle though. Recoil. Yeah, to be fair, that recoil's harder than anything. Right, so. Let's go north first and work out what's down these ladders. Ooh. Some funky upbeat music. That's what's down these ladders. No way! Yes! Well, that couldn't have gone any better. Healing zone. I <laughs> wish I'd have known about that on the first run through. Perfect. Right, so I'm guessing then the only way through is going to be the ladders to the south. So let's have a look down here. Yes, they're still down here. Oh, I keep forgetting that B actually makes you sprint in this. And this is this trainer that popped up the last time and wiped me out. Because he had a Spearow that destroyed the Zubat that I had that had no moves left. And uh, Bulbasaur wiped it out in a couple of packs. So, Let's see if we can do better with this setup. So, I think we'll go in with the uh, confusion. Set that right after. And then, you know, while I've been grinding as well in between episodes, that confusion's been absolutely naff. Sorry, supersonic. It's been absolutely rubbish. Oh, again. Twice in a row. And I've been literally been in battles where five times in a row it's attacked even though it's confused, which I mean uh, it's a little bit underpowered and then two turns, doesn't hit itself, and now he's no longer confused. Perfect. So let's try and put that in again. Well wow, that quick attack is pretty powerful. There we go. So the supersonic hits this time. Come on, this time. There we go. Nice one, so let's get back to back to the leech life. Hopefully, it hits itself again. Confuse no more. One turn. Doesn't matter because we're going to finish it anyway, so it really makes no odds. Oh, unless that's a crit. No crit. Thank you very much. Leech life. Perfect. Nice one. Thank you, Rattata. How much is 85 XP? is not bad. Now, I think we're going to have to be uh, using Squirtle for this spear. Let's go Saviour. Right. Saviour. You know what? I don't even think we need to do much setting up, to be honest. I think... Oh! We wouldn't have had to if uh, things were just hit. And that's a critical, but he's at it up, so it's not too bad. He's got a pretty good defence, Squirrel. So, let's... Now, what does more damage? Bubble or Tackle? Bubble stab, so... Ah, still. Not really, doesn't do really much more than Tackle does. Yeah, well, at least we're safe through the battle. And then, I 
think he has one more. I'm from Remember Riley. There it is. Another retire. Let's smash that one as well. Beautiful. Give us the bubble. Game down. Another quick attack. But I would like a retire, I'm not gonna lie. Because it's. He gets the quick attack, which is one thing, and then once you uh, get it evolved, you get Hyper Fang on the Rat Kate. I mean, that is absolutely power. Well, you hate losing. Well, guess what? You lost. You don't belong here, kid. Yeah, you know where I belong, mate. Pokemon League Championships. Motherfucker. Moonstone. Nice one. Well, I guess that's going to come in useful at some point, maybe. Would be nice if we could get a, get a Nidoran's an encounter, get a Nido King at some point. That'd be pretty cool. I'd even take a Clefable, actually. Is there anything else Gen 1 evolved with a Moonstone? Hmm. Let me know. I'm just sure confused no more. Hurt yourself due to confusion. That's cool. We're going to leech you then. Finished him off. Beautiful. So, I was feeling like I'd gone the wrong way then, even though I was pretty sure this was the only way to go. Okay. Is there another lady down? Is that someone I've not battled yet? I'm about to find out. Uh, if I get through these encounters. See, now the only thing with. Um, Speed boosting is uh, it's risky that you're not paying enough attention to what's going on. You like to lose a mon, but I don't think I'm going to fall for that. And if I keep coming up against level three and four Zubats, I may just run because they're not giving me any XP anyway. It's barely worth bothering. Let's get out of here. I also need to remember that the B buttons run because I just keep walking everywhere. <laughs> right, another Zubat. And right in there, potion, that will come in handy. In fact, I might slap a potion on my zoo back now just to be safe. Because he's not looking too good. Perfect. Oh man, there's that healing place. Well, I'm not walking away back there though. Oh yeah, you come up the stairs to me, bitch. I'm not coming down to you. Yo, dude, what Love that. Reminds me of the Dudley boys. who got inducted into the WWE Hall of Fame this year, which was uh, quite a funny exception speech. If you've not seen that, check it out. Supersonic. Cool. I've been finding that the... Um... Oh, that's cool. I've been finding that Leech Life's actually been really good against Shiru for some reason while I've been in this cave. I don't know if that's just because I've been a higher level. Yeah, yeah, that's doing nothing. But it keeps hitting itself. Which is bang on. I'll have another leech life from you. Perfect. That's itself again. Man, I'm glad I did that little bit of grinding because if I'd have gone into these battles at level 7, it would have been difficult, man. So, just to remember, I'm still trying to get Zubat up to level 15 so I can get him to learn by it so I can actually do some decent damage with it. Unless, of course, I get a TM sooner than that that he can learn. I don't think that's going to happen, though. Yeah, well, we've, we've devoured this Joe dude anyway. It's took a bit of time, but down he goes, and hopefully that's going to give us a little bit of XP. Should be a decent amount, I think. Wow, how have I not got him finished yet? I thought that was the end. That defence girl. Man. Right, cool. Another Joe dude. Uh, yeah, let's keep uh, Zubat in for this one. We'll hit the supersonic and then we'll swap out to Squirrel and finish him off. Dude is confused, hurts itself in confusion. Let's hit the bubble on this thing. That's super effective. 
Yeah, and I'm like four levels higher, so that's gonna wipe it out. That's what I like to see. And Redeemer gets level 12, three levels away from having a decent attacking move. And there we go. Perfect. What's this guy got to say? Yes, you do. Or train stronger Pokemon, generally, is the better thing to do. She's a battle. Do we take her? Yes, we do. <sighs> oh no, I'm all alone with you. What will we do? Ooh! Coming on to me, lass. I like that. Need to be careful. You'll be getting me in trouble, man. Right. Yeah, let's hit the supersonic and switch switch out again. Nope, not this time. Growl, that levels attack, right? Yeah, that's okay, because I'm not using attacking moves anyway. So let's get that out of there. Before it's confused. Another growl. Not gonna make any difference, mate. Now we'll get Sadie back in here. Finish this Clefairy off. That's a Clefairy I could do with, to be honest. Got that Moonstone there. Sort myself out with a Clefable. Doing a bit of Sing, Minimize, all that kind of crap. That could come in handy. Bang. Well, I love that Bubble like slows down speed. Like, as if you're in a room full of bubbles, you're going to move really slowly because you don't want to pop them. <laughs> Fair is confused, hurts itself, good, because I'm really not doing much damage to it right now. Yeah, I need, I really need a water gun, I think. Do I get water gun, or does this thing learn headbutt before that and save you? I don't know, but I'm going to hit him. So, we're getting through the first cave in the game. There's a sign there which makes me think that I'm near the end, and I'm pretty sure there's a route out of the end of here that's going to give me another encounter. Oh, speaking of water gun. Yes, I will, thank you. What PP is water gun? Oh, you can't see on this, can you? Damn it. Um, well, I may as well just replace bubble straight up because I know it's got enough PP, it's not going to run out straight away. And it's going to do good damage. Yes, you lost, you rubbish. Mercen Cave, Route 54 up ahead, perfect. Oh man, there's another battle. I really thought we were at the end then. Yeah, I'll take him on. All about the grind. Hey, want to play? Yep, yeah, let's play. Hey, hey, are you ready to play? It's time to come and play with Saint Denial on his new channel. Uh, Again, I'm still really interested to find out about these new typings on this as well, because that's something I've not really looked up and I don't know anything about. Is it already? No, it's not already confused. So I was just wondering why I keep missing. There we go. Beautiful. And it hurts itself. Doing me a favour means I ain't got to. And let's get Saviour out there to mop up. String shot. Slow me down. Don't care, mate. Do not care. I'm faster than you because you are a caterpillar. Are you a caterpillar? Are you a worm? What, what actually are you? Hmm. Well, he's dead anyway, and I'm poisoned, which is a good job that I stopped planning to do while I was grinding in between episodes. So, here comes another Weedle, and let's get an antidote on the trip on the job. Uh -huh. Goes to the point of sigma. If that poisons again, oh, I was going to be so salty then. Uh, what gun? Ooh, not even a crit. And then knocks his whole health down. Cause it's stab. And we'll finish him off with a tackle. Ah man, how is a cappy? How is a fucking cappy? How is a weedle faster than a squirrel? That makes no sense. But got you gone. I did get you, you're right. Now can you just be the last guy in here so I can just get out of here please? That'd be grand. Oh, item, that's tempting. Tim 34, ooh, what is that? I'm about to find out. Tim 34, bide. Yeah. Who can learn it? Everyone apparently. <laughs> Let's hold on to it, see if I can catch someone with, with high HP stat. Like a Chansey. Magic, <laughs> I just caught a Chansey, man. 
Oh, is this guy battle? You just made it out of the cave. Oh, I should have left him alone. Fuck off, man. Super nerd. Super dick. Okay. Here we go. Oh, that little spear again. Let's hit the supersonic and then switch out. Oh, this is going to be my... Probably be my tactic until... Until I get him up to level 15, he learns to bite. Sorry about the pauses, I'm still learning how to talk and play at the same time. Attack goes down, don't think that should be a problem because tackle should hit it hard enough. Oh! Oh, and that peck's not too bad, man. Let's see a look. I'm going to play them risky games today. I'm not losing this one. I ain't even started this Nuzlocke last episode. I'm not losing another Nuzlocke within like five episodes. I'm telling you, I'm going to at least get some gym badges this time. And I think for future reference, I might... Um, every time I get to a gym... I mean, I'm going to save in between episodes anyway. But every time I get to a gym, uh, I may do a separate save state. Or in change Pokemon. No. And then I will uh, make that my checkpoint. Every time I hit a gym, that is my checkpoint. And I will go back to that. Uh, in case I do lose. Obviously, if I lose before the gym, then I'll be starting all over again. Again. Either that or I'll just give it up as a bad job. <laughs> all gone. That's not very effective, man. This is getting the grind now. Another water gun. Here we go, critical hit, just what I needed. That crit mattered. Um, get ourselves up to level 14. Hey, we'll be evolving soon. Geodude's not going to be a problem because I'll knock him out and won't go with a water gun. There he goes. You are going down, Geodude! Get down. Purple vet. See you later, super nerd. You're a super fucking nerd. So, next we are... Ooh, are some of these item patches? Man, I wish I could... Uh... Ooh, okay, so this is my encounter for this route, Route 54. And it's a Pidgey, which is absolutely fine with me. Uh, so, how do we go about this then? I start thinking of nicknames, really. So let's go with the tackle. Oh man, what I mean, what do I do now? Am I going to be able to get him? Let's have a go. Yeah, nicely done. To give the nickname to Pidgey, yes. Call him. Uh, Spidge. Because that's a disgusting name. Uh, not with a DGE though, with a J. Spidge. Because I'm that kind of crazy motherfucker. But again, nothing in that item slot. I feel like there's a hidden item around here though. Right, well. Ratatas in this route, and I could have had one, but no, I've got myself a Pidgey. At least, though, if I can keep hold of Pidgey, that he can he can learn fly, which will be really useful later on. So, Ratatas confused, still uses its tackle because it's a little shit. Uh, let's get Pidgey out there, why not? Hopefully. I guess the tail whip, that's defense lowered. Oh, that's scary. Let's try the gust. Perfect, thank you very much, Rotata. I'm gonna hit with the gust, just gonna knock you down a bit further. Oh, yes. Still confused. God, tail whip again, but it misses. Go for the gust. I feel like if it hit a quick attack right now, I would be okay. Wait, it's just gonna keep going for the tail whip because it's an idiot. Yeah, you just played yourself. That is that. Thank you very much. 
Bish bash bosh. Oh man. Don't want to see a cute Pokemon. Your Pokemon may be Pokemon. It's a new brand. Pokemon. Your Pokemon might be cute. My Pokemon are sick as fuck. Oh god. Oh dear. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. Oh, thank goodness for that, Jigglypuff. You are my saviour. You are my saviour. Oh wait, no. I've already got a saviour. And his name is Saviour. You see him as well? Oh man, sleep is so OP. <sighs> right, well, before we wait, well, before we do anything, let's heal. I don't think I've got an awakening, so I am just going to have to ride it out. And. Yeah, this is. Um, Squirtle's probably the most tanky one I've got, so he's just going to have to sit and take the damage. Oh. I really thought it was going to go straight for Singlin as soon as I woke up. Right, let's get this thing down. Big tackle. Ah, see. Super effective. Ah, well, now you see, that's going to be that new typing. Why was that super effective into Jigglypuff, a normal type? Someone let me know. If you've ever played Pokemon Brand, let me know what extra type Jigglypuff's got that's just made that tackle super effective. Because otherwise, I'm never going to learn. But what I have learned, it is super effective, so I'm going to keep smashing it. Maybe normal is super effective against. Oh, I don't know. I don't. What types were they? Gas. Oh man, I can't even remember now. Is it like a? Oh, it's like another type, like unnormal, not normal, abnormal. That is it. Maybe it's abnormal type, and that makes it weak against normal. Who knows? Perfect. Well, that's good. I've got anyway. And. He goes, lass, stop, don't be so mean to my puffies. Don't be so mean to my puffies. Right, can I? I mean, I don't really want to skip that man because I want the XP, but I also would like to get to heal. It would be nice. If this is a city, I and mean, then I will come back to him. Oh my god, it's got the Lavender Down theme tune. I really don't need that just before I'm about to go to bed. Oh, I'm going to have nightmares about Lavender Town. Right, so let's see what's this. Oh, is that a. Can you get an encounter in that spot? Hello! Yes, thank you. It's so good to finally be at Pokemon Center. I can't even describe. Right, let's talk to everybody in these places because you never know what who's got what. So, let's just speedy here. Pokemon love it here. So do I. I wonder. Pokemon training, possibly entrepreneurial. Uh, I'll let you know when I'm a YouTube millionaire. If that's an encounter, then I feel like that is a separate... Yeah, it's a new encounter because I'm in the city now. I'm going to come down to that in a second. Pokemon Fan Club. Oh, if this is like in the first generation, then this guy is going to give me... Uh, a bike coupon. Brilliant, thank you. Cool. I don't. I mean, I don't know where you exchange it, but it could be somewhere. Okay. Um, let's have a look. Hi, Cubo. I've already said hi to it. Why aren't you giving me something? Are all these people just boring? They're not going to give me any free items. Yes, I'm a good trainer. Oh. Maybe if I say no, he'll make friends with me. Can you give me your Pokemon then? Please. No. I'm not going to do that. If I'm a bad trainer, why would you want my Pokemon? What was the gym in this town? Merson Gym. Carp Man. Carp Man. Sounds like a water type. And Merson City. The noble little town. Oh, isn't that cute? Alright, let's go to the mart and stock up on stuff. See if we've got anything new. Thanks, mate. So, let's have... In fact, actually, as well, what have I got to sell? 
I feel like I've not really picked up anything worth anything. Uh, Moonstone, oh, not worth anything. Wait, is that what I selected? Yeah. Escape route, I'll keep that. Oh uh, yeah, oh, I don't really picked anything up, but I have got enough to get a few potions uh, in case I get stuck in the gym. And I'll also, oh, water stone. Could be useful. Oh, they've not even got antidotes or anything like that. Uh, how many Pokeballs have I got actually? Three. Yeah, some couple of Pokeballs as well. Perfect. Because I want to go and see what kind of encounter I can get outside of that place. I tried facing the Pokemon Gym Leader, but I'm way too weak to fight him. Yeah, it's because you're shite, mate. I think you're tough. Go face Cartman. I'm gonna. What's up here first? This guy's not gonna let me pass. Where is he? Hi, kid. Want to see my Pokemon? Yeah, sure. Let's do it. Oh, man. I shouldn't have done this. This is gonna be stupid. Oh, level 11. Yeah, that is a bit stupid. Should have done the gym first. Okay. Oh, come on, this is the time that you need to be hitting these things, man. That lowers my attack. Supersonic hits. Vera's confused. Ah, oh, man, I pressed too fast and I hit Supersonic again. What's wrong with me? Come on, waste of a move. Uh, right. Let's get Savior out of there. Goes to the ground again. Does he know any offensive moves? Let's go for water, go and find out. Well, it's not confused anymore. Perfect. That's because I wasted that turn. So we hit the water gun. That's going to do decent damage, I hope. Yeah, not too bad. And the growl's going to keep lowering my attack, so it's going to take three or four goes, man. There's two. Eh, number three, here we go. Not too bad. Good hit. There we go. Damn. Good XP as well. I swear, I swear this savior's leveling up more than Redeemer is. Okay, so let's switch Spidgin and then just switch him straight back out because I don't want him to fight a level 11 Slowpoke. This is probably a tank. Slowpoke goes Confusion. Definitely got to switch him out now. And uh, we're going to try to tackle because I feel like Slowpoke could be an abnormal type as well. Why not? No, go to back for confusion again. Now confusion's not doing too much, so I think maybe the water gun will be okay. Stab, more damage. Not very effective though. Oh yeah, part water type. Was it part ice type? That's no, water type. Well, that leaves me in a bit of a shit position, doesn't it? Let's just keep mashing the tackle for that. And then we have to heal part way through as well. Oh, that is not what I wanted. Of course it does, because even though none of mine hit, every time one hits me, it has to confuse me. Right. Let's try this again. I really shouldn't have come and battled this trainer. One more. And then let's do it. Fight, we're gonna go with tackle. Ah, man. Oh, come on, I really need to hit this time. Oh, man, this is this is torture. If that Chris, that's killing me off. But both of my little Pokemon are flying types, and I'm flying weak to psychic. So, if he goes for that confusion, it is gonna smash me up. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, I can't keep anything out. <sighs> Fuck. I might have to sack someone off. <sighs> oh, it's just mashing confusion. Oh, well, there goes Redeemer. Bye bye Redeemer, thank you, you did your job absolutely admirably, but unfortunately 
I have made a stupid decision by coming and taking this fight, and now you are dead to the world. Uh, it's going to keep me from that confusion, but thankfully though, my saviour's not confused anymore, so that's pretty cool. And there's a tackle, and Slowpoke goes down. Well, that's a level up for Spidge at least. And um, I can get an encounter there as well. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and heal up. I'm going to get the encounter on that route north, which I believe is a different route. Let me just check this map that I've got, just, just to make sure. i just got a map here to make sure I don't get any illegal encounters. That's the only reason I'm using it. Medicine City Gym. Route 55, is that what it is north of there, I think? So, if that's Route 55... Oh wait, shit, yeah, I need to put... Um, zoom back into the graveyard. Sorry, Zubat. See ya, bud. <sighs> Gutted. I mean, that Zubat, we were like, that, man! Right, so, let's get Spidge up front so we can start switch trading him. And I'm going to have a war turtle soon, so that's really going to um, power me up a little bit. I can get this encounter in this route as well. It's a new route, so it is a Nuzlocke encounter. Let's see what I get. Or will I get anything, actually? Hey, finally. And it is... Oh, it's Ekins! It's Snacky Snack! I like that. Right. Come on, Spidge, you can do this for me. Or can you? Like, what's that level of defence? Oh, I hate that. Only knows rap. Or what that does mean. Hits multiple times. Yeah. Means I can't switch out. Oh, it's still rapping me, man. Oh, my days! Man, I can't go for another move, because if it gets me in that wrap again, I'm absolutely fucked. It misses, of course it does. Right, so let's go for... Oh man, that's going to be too powerful. I should have gone for the tackle. Oh! <sighs> no sticky snack for my team. Well, I've still got the encounter outside the Pokemon Center, so that's pretty cool. Let's go and heal up, and then I will get that encounter as well. Now, in that route up there, they've, that encounter was level 7, if I, I think it was. So hopefully this one down here should be about the same. Which would be useful. A few levels higher than the route previously. Okay, encounter straight away, that's good. Ekins again. So... <gasps> Oh no! No, no, no! Oh. Is it worth it? Level 17 is high, man. I'd like to get my hands on that to help me get through this gym. I'll tell you that right now. Uh, okay, so water gun this time I think is a good thing to do. Please don't poison with poison sting. At least it doesn't only know rap, because that is annoying. Right, yeah, so we're here. But it goes through rap, just as I've mentioned it. Fuck off. Now I can't move. <sighs> oh, and it knows bite, and I flinch. Man, what kind of luck is that? Tell you that, snake must lay lucky eggs. <sighs> right, okay. Honestly, I've, I've, I've hit it once. It's done about 10 moves on me. I've hit it once. So there's that water gun. One more of them and we start throwing balls at it. There we go. Ooh, that crit definitely mattered. 
Jeez. So let's get the Pokeball. Come on. Stay in. Stay in. Yes, get in. So we've got a snacky snack. And do you want to give a nickname to Ekins? Yes, we do. I'm going to call him Snacky. Oh, wait. No. Wait. No. That's not ice spell. I can't do spell. I'm going to do Snacky, but I'm going to do two Ks. And then a Snacky. Wait, did that save? Yeah. Cool. Whoa. Right, so. Now we've managed to get that on our team. That's a pretty good replacement for a Zubat, really. It's poison type, just like the Zubat was, so I'll get that advantage again. That wrap is a pretty cool move for early on in the game, maybe not so much later on. Oh, although actually it could come useful in a pinch. I imagine I'm probably going to swap it out for something else eventually, though, if I can manage to keep hold of him. So let's get up to the gym, and we're going to leave that episode, this episode there in front of the gym. And we will step in next time, take on the trainers, hopefully everything will go well, and then we'll take on the leader. Water-type leader. What's his name again? Carp Man. Like, let's call him Eric. Eric Carp Man. Right. Thank you very much for watching episode 3 of my brown Nuzlocke. Uh, please subscribe, like the video if you liked it, there's going to be more to come. Also, I'm planning on doing some live streams soon. Uh, I've got uh, Resident Evil set up ready to go, uh, the original Resident Evil PlayStation 1, I'm going to be doing a live stream of that uh, within the next couple of weeks, so thank you very much for watching, peace.